special thanks to MGA, Just Play, Hasbro, and Briar for sending these products to us for free. What's up, doll collectors and gift givers? Here is another My Froggy Stuff Holiday Buyer's Guide. We are taking a look at a few of the things on the shelves this holiday season in hopes to make your holiday shopping a little easier. Let's start off with a little style. From Hasbro's Disney Style series, we have Jasmine and Aurora. This line features Disney princesses in glamorous fashion of today. Now, I bought both of these dolls on Amazon. They were $24.99 each. Jasmine is doll number five, and Aurora is doll number six in this series. On the back of the box, it says, Pink is back in, and let's not forget who wore it first. The color is inspired by Aurora's classic story, but everything else is cut out of the contemporary world. Out of the box, this doll stands a little under 12 inches tall with her shoes on. She has blonde hair and rooted eyelashes, wears a one-shouldered dress with glitter printed details, a gold ribbon belt, a gold bracelet, and a purse. And at the bottom, it opens up and you can see some tulle and a shiny underskirt. The fabric continues all the way around and the dress velcros in the back. And she wears a pair of gold strappy shoes. Jasmine sparkles. Like the star speckled sky in this contemporary style designed with her bold personality in mind. Out of the box, she wears her hair pulled up in a ponytail with a gold colored rubber band. She has lashes, gold colored triangle earrings, she wears a teal dress with tulle and glitter at the top. Then there is a tulle ruffle going around the bottom. A faux leather belt with gold details. The dress wraps in the front. Her legs are made out of a purple colored plastic. She wears gold shoes and carries a jewel purse. These dolls can move at the head, the shoulder, the elbow. There is a limited range there. They also have movement at the wrist and at the hip. If you prefer sneakers over heels, here is the Disney Princess Comfy Squad. Priced at $12.99, we did a full review for these last year, but in our review, I do believe they came in two packs. So now at most major retailers, you can find them in single packs. But new this year, here is the Disney Princess Comfy Squad Cinderella's Sweet Scooter. Available Fall 2020, this playset has a suggested retail price of $29.99. On the back of the box, it says, Imagine Cinderella going for a more casual look as she rides her scooter to the Sugar Rush World to visit her friend, Vanellope Von Sweets. Out of the box, I am already seeing some things that make me very happy. Do you see that? She has flat feet and it is possible to balance her to stand. And are those knees? Wait, did I miss something? Do the other dolls have knees? Uh, no. This doll just has movement at the head, shoulder, elbow, wrist, and hip. And she stands on her tiptoes. Whereas Cindy here has movement at the shoulder, the elbow, the wrist, the neck, the hip, and knee, and she has flat feet. Her scooter is shades of blue, white, and pink. There is storage under the seat, a kickstand, and the wheels do move. There are braces for her hands. She has a helmet because, you know, safety first. She also comes with stickers to decorate the scooter. She comes wearing a blue headband, a jacket and top that are sewn together and Velcro in the back, and a glitter skirt with an elastic waistband. Disney Princess Comfy Squad Sweet Treats Truck with a suggested retail price of $49.99. Dolls not included. Imagine the Disney princesses enjoying sweet treats at the Sugar Rush Super Speedway. Assembly is required. And their stickers. You know, me and stickers don't always get along that great. But here we go. Bam! The stickers definitely make it colorful. When the sweet treats truck arrives on the scene, 
We have wheels that move, a popsicle that folds down to reveal a slurpy machine. There are drink accessories. On the other side, there's a door that lifts up, creating a counter with a window so the princesses can order their sweets. Don't worry, it'll look better once the truck is expanded. In the front, there's a pretzel steering wheel. There's a seat for one in the front with a seat belt. The seat is removable. There is a giant ice cream sandwich on the top, which is actually a table. Let me show you. Lift the ice cream scooper handle and expand the truck. Fold out the table and you're open for business. I am loving the table. When we made our custom Vanellope Von Sweets bedroom, we gave her an ice cream sandwich bed. There are little chocolate pieces for the seats, lots of seating for the princesses. There's a cotton candy maker that spins the cotton candy. Take the little holder from the side, place the cotton candy on top, and now the dolls can hold it. There is a little ice cream station, and remember, this opens. This can lift up. There is ice cream inside. Use the ice cream scoop. Can we scoop it out? Ah, uh, we can pretend. Come on. Take an ice cream cone and place the ice cream on top. Ah. To make a scoop of ice cream in an ice cream cone. Here you go, Cinderella. This playset has over 15 pieces. Sweet. Y'all, there is a Disney Princess Comfy Squad castle. Over 32 inches tall, six pieces of furniture, 16 accessories, dolls not included. Assembly is required. Put aside like an hour or two because there are a lot of pieces and stickers. The castle is shades of pink with shades of blue and gold details. I'm really enjoying all of this Disney crossover. Let's go inside. There are paperboard printed backgrounds that look just like scenes from the movie, Ralph Breaks the Internet. There's an upstairs and a downstairs, a vanity with a mirror and a stool, a long lounge, chair, a fabric bean bag. We have a little table right here and a closet for accessories like the hangers that are included. And there are a lot of other accessories like this Mickey Mouse mug and pie. This castle has a suggested retail price of $99.99. This year, Briar launched Main Beauty, which is a horse styling head. I've seen this on Amazon priced around $25. You can also find them at briarhorses.com and at Tractor Supply. There are three different horses to collect. This is Blaze, and there is also Sunset and Daybreak. This includes over 50 pieces, including a styling booklet, a main comb, hair clips, four hair spirals, and 50 elastics. I think these horses have an absolutely gorgeous profile. Blaze is kind of my favorite because he has the same coloring as Johnny. And that hair is super soft. So we can just play with the mane, combing it and styling it to make your own mane beauty. Oh my goodness, my braids are getting so much better. And if you got a smart doll, we can take some pretty good pictures pretending they got a horse. From Just Play, we are taking a look at Hair Dorables. Big hair, don't care. This is the hair art series with 11 surprises inside and 26 new dolls to collect. On the back, you can get an idea of the different surprises that are included. These dolls are about $12, $12.99, somewhere around there. It comes in a plastic case that's reusable, and that is awesome because, you know, we love things to be reusable. Inside, we have some little surprise bags. Here is the doll. There is a scene inside the box, but it is kind of small when compared to previous series. The collector's guide has a poster on one side and a list of dolls on the other. We have after school fun and masquerade. I am all for a casual look, so the after school fun is definitely my fave. I'm just gonna start with the doll and let's see who we have. 
It's Noah! She has blue and pink hair, pouty lips, wears a pink top, and yellow pants. They are two separate pieces. The top has Velcro and the pants have an elastic waistband. Begin opening the surprises to find the parts needed to complete the doll stand and shoes, stickers, a hair clip, and an accessory. Ooh, we have a camera. It's a pink camera with painted details. And if you look closely at the lens, it says at hair Dorables loves. That's cool. And everything can be neatly stored inside the case. Last year, Just Play introduced a totally tiny. These are miniatures that are perfect for the dollhouse. They have fun themes like Sweet Treats Cafe, Taco Time, Pizza Party, and Rise and Shine, which is like breakfast. And this year at Walmart, I found Chocolate Delight and Sushi Dinner. Right now at walmart.com, it says that the price is $9.97. And I've seen other themes floating around online, like on Instagram, but I've been having a very difficult time finding them, so this is all I've been able to find so far. Each pack has 16 pieces. It includes a surprise slimy ooze topping and more toppings. On the back, it says create your own dessert or create your own meal. Make it, create it, top it. Or frost it, create it, make it. In the Chocolate Delight set, we have a serving tray, candy apples, chocolate covered marshmallows on sticks. I think these are cake pops. Chocolate sandwich cookies. Some kind of sliced bread. I'm gonna guess it's like a cinnamon bread. I don't know, help me out with that one. Totally tiny chocolate sauce a chocolate fountain that spins, and a spoon. And yes, this set does include toppings, which look like little pink foam balls, and slime. Do not eat. These items are perfect for the dollhouse. I use them with our one six scale figures. If you prefer savory over sweet, let's take a look at the sushi dinner. We have a little mat here in the packaging. It's made of paper, but totally works. Then there's a boat and it does move. See that when it goes back and forth? Then we have different types of sushi. These three are stuck together. It's orange in the center. These are yellow. This one has fish on top and this one is shrimp. You can have edamame and soy sauce or pot stickers. I think it's pretty cool how the little chopsticks can hold stuff. There's a little bottle of soy sauce and a tea set with painted blue flowers. This set also comes with the topping and the slime, but I usually play with it as is. Totally Tiny Packs are one of those toys where you can have multiple copies and pretend like you're feeding a whole family, or better yet, a restaurant. Sorry, I get pretty excited when I talk about miniatures. From MGA, this is the limited edition LOL Surprise OMG Remix Super Surprise. Wow, that's a name. I bought this at Target. It had a suggested retail price of $129, but I just looked online and now it's like on sale, so. There are 70 plus surprises, over $200 value, unbox two rock bands, four dolls, four fashion dolls, four musical instruments. Open the front to reveal a boombox with a lot of numbers. There's a number guide. Ugh. I mean, yay! It looks like this is all about the unboxing experience, where you follow along to reveal the surprises. Rock on! The Supersonics and their opening act sisters are about to shred the ultimate rock show. But backstage, things are out of control as both bands try to get ready to take the stage. Follow the steps to unbox and help these BBs find their instruments and fashions so they're ready to rock. One, remove dial. There's a number one, so let's remove the dial. Um, how do I do that without breaking a nail? Oh, it's this part. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Take out the surprise. We have a paper bag and inside it has teeny tiny shoes. 
Green and black shoes for an LOL surprise doll. Number two, remove dial. Why am I still having trouble? Okay, hang on. Here we go, I'm using my dotting tool. And there we go. Remove the surprise. A pair of pink and black shoes. Number three, spin to reveal. This time we got a little guitar. Four, spin to reveal. There we go. Another guitar. Five, spin to reveal. And I think six is spin to reveal as well. Yep. I think these are symbols. My musical instruments are a little rusty. And we have a keyboard. Then we go to number seven on the other side and it starts over. Revealing more shoes, sunglasses for the OMG dolls, and a golden hair accessory. Find number 13 on top of package and pull to open outer package. What? There's 13 right there, so I'm just supposed to pull? Like, oh, well, this is moving. Okay. And, ah, it opens up. Swing open outer package side to reveal next layer of surprises. Remove box number 34 and save for later. Okay, so we did that, and uh, there's box 34. Yeah, so this is getting pretty detailed. Lots of instructions. Ooh, that's cool. Repeat on the other side. Pull open like opening a cassette player. And there is a surprise. We have a guitar. There is an on-off switch in the back. And when you press the buttons, it makes music. I really like how all of this opens up, creating a great backdrop for the OMG dolls. Check out that backstage door. And I am totally loving all of the neon lights. But personally, I do find the scavenger hunt a little tedious. But that's just me, because I like to open the box and start playing right away. Ooh, we got drums. And they make noise! This folds down, creating a platform with more surprises to be found behind it. Here we have an LOL surprise doll. Continue following the steps to open the surprises and reveal the dolls until everyone is dressed. There is a lot of layered clothing which can make it a little difficult to get them dressed, but once they are, they are totally ready to go. Here is Ferocious, Bad Girl, Fame Queen, and Metal Chick. And from opening act, we have Fierce, Batty, Go-Go Queen, and Metal Babe. They all have instruments. All of the OMG's instruments make sounds. And I absolutely love the background. It definitely sells the idea of a rock and roll lifestyle. These dolls are articulated with movement at the head, shoulder, elbow, wrist, hip, and they have a snap knee. Each OMG doll comes with a doll stand, making them a little easier to display. Oh, and their hands are removable. Just be careful when removing them so you don't break them. After the show, you can take the band on tour with the LOL Surprise OMG Remix 4-in-1 Plane with 50 surprises and working lights. I bought this playset at Target. It had an original retail price of $89.99, but I went online and looked today and there are a few sales. Some assembly is required. The wings fold down, and it says BB Air on the side. Open it up to take a look around. Dolls not included. There is seating with seat belts, fold out tray tables. We can have a doll pilot the plane. There are overhead compartments for storage. You can close the windows. And this little button right here, we can push that to turn on the lights. And there's another button in the back for more lights. Open the surprises to find accessories like luggage that can neatly be stored away in the overhead compartments. Actually, I don't think it can close. Nah. Then there is more luggage and accessories to make flying BB Air more enjoyable. Remove the front of the plane for the mixing booth. 
pull the button in the front to release the car. Then slide down the wings to turn the cabin into a recording studio. Here is the LOL surprise Big BB. Look, I'm so big. Unbox my style. This is DJ. This doll has a suggested retail price of $39.99. On the front of the box, it says new shoes, mix and match looks, fashion surprises. On the back, it says, welcome to my channel. Just got back from a shopping spree and can't wait to share. Join me as I unbox all my fashion finds and create new looks. All right, so I guess this doll is an influencer. At the bottom, you can see that there are three dolls to collect. And it says, package becomes a playset to record unboxings. Out of the box, some assembly is required. Let's unwrap this. It's a cardboard desk. And there is a backdrop and a couple cardboard cutouts. To make the backdrop, stand up and create a cardboard chair. To make a playset for the BB to record their unboxing videos. The set is very cute, very colorful. I love the idea of a backdrop for unboxing videos, but I would have liked to have seen something a little sturdier than cardboard. However, it can support the doll's weight. The doll stands about 11 inches tall. It can move at the head, the shoulder, and at the hip. DJ wears a white and gold one piece with a printed chain. She can be balanced to stand and has gold painted fingernails. She comes with four packages to unbox so we can place her behind the desk and pretend like she's unboxing. What's up, babies? It's your girl DJ here getting ready to show you some fresh new looks. Sorry, I just couldn't help myself. I do wish that the background was a little bit wider, but this will probably work pretty good for like square videos or maybe vertical because if I want to get the table, I do lose a lot of the top of her head. But maybe that's okay, because that's where I'm holding her anyway. Let's check this one out first. Inside, we have some tissue paper. And in that tissue paper, we have accessories. Ah, they're earrings. Her ears are pierced, so she can rock this look. Let's check out the gold package. Inside, we find clothing items like shiny black shorts with ribbon details on the sides and a gold jacket with faux zippers. Let's open this box. And this is... Ah! Oh, it's a backpack that says straight out of daycare. Okay. And in our last box, which is a shoe box, I'm assuming we're getting shoes. Black and white lace-up sneakers. Completing this little influencer's look. I wonder if this backdrop could be used with other dolls. Like Rainbow High Dolls. These dolls came out this year and I was very impressed with their fashion. Priced at $26.99 at Target, these dolls come with two complete outfits. Themed after the rainbow, these dolls come in a variety of colors. We do have a full review on these dolls if you would like to see them in a little more detail. In my opinion, this is definitely a line worth looking at this holiday season. Thank you for joining us while we took a look at some of the items on the shelves this holiday season. Let us know in the comments down below which items caught your eye. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell and follow us on Instagram at MyFroggyStuff and the Frog Vlog. And we will see you next time. Bye! Happy Holidays!
Yes, every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday.